and welcome back. Um, I'm going to be packing because Mike and I are going to take a little road trip down to Tennessee and I thought I would do a little pack with me video because there's two things that you need to know about me. It's I'm an overpacker and I'm very dramatic. So... <laughs> and I are going to be taking a little road trip to Tennessee. We're stopping in Virginia and then we're going to finish up our way to Tennessee and then obviously come back. Um, so I am going to just pack some stuff. I already kind of started packing like my shampoos and everything but as far as like clothes go I figured I was like oh let's let's pack some stuff together. So we're gonna we're gonna pack a few things maybe some things if mike and i decide that we want to go to like a nicer restaurant which is probably not going to happen but just in case we don't really have a lot of like nice clothes just because i don't know it's just like look look at me i'm always in like t-shirts and stuff we're gonna start off and put those clothes at the bottom because they're more, more likely not to get taken out so i'm bringing two jumpsuits i couldn't decide which one to bring um so i'm bringing this one from abercrombie so nice so cute love this one i've worn this one it's fabulous bringing her and then we're gonna bring this one from lulu's which i haven't worn and i'll be honest it's a little long so if i wear it i'm gonna have to get some pins or something but again really cute the hotel that we're staying at has a gym so i'm gonna bring two pairs of leggings just in case two sports bras and two workout tops now we're definitely gonna need a few pairs of pants options. I'm probably gonna bring the ones that I have now that have a, like an excessive amount of holes in it, but then we need a pair of pants without holes in it, just in case. Of course, we gotta bring, you know, some overalls. They have holes in them, of course. So let me let me bring these back a little bit. I should probably film it from back here, but you know, we got some nice overall action. I look really cute in these overalls, so like, why wouldn't I bring them? And now we have to have some top options. So even though it's supposed to be like in like the 60s and 70s when we're there, um, who knows, anything can happen. So I'm bringing, you know, like a little crew neck, just in case. Plain black t-shirt, cause you know we need it. My little tank top, little mock turtleneck top, my white bodysuit from Abercrombie to go with my overalls. I only wear bodysuits when I'm wearing my overalls because I just look weird with just a bodysuit on and obviously pants. And this other little shirt that was also in my spring haul if you were interested in checking that out and to complete the look for any occasion i'm bringing this denim jacket with some rips in it obviously oh and i need leggings because i'm not doing denim on denim black cloud leggings from balance so i'll be honest i don't really own a lot of shoes i own like three pairs of shoes just not my thing but i do have these incredibly dirty white more dusty white sneakers that I would wear with my, one of my jumpsuits. So we're gonna put these in here, just in case. I'm just gonna bring these shoes just in case, you know, we go for like a walk or if I go in the gym or something like that. So I'll have some sort of like working out shoes. I'm not gonna bring my lifting shoes, AKA my knockoff Converse, just because I don't really plan on like lifting anything heavy when I'm there. All right, so this is kind of what the duffel bag situation is looking like. It's not as overpacked as I thought I was gonna be little change of scenery so now we're gonna fill up this bag so this is the bag that I'm pretty much going to put like my toiletry stuff in um, all that fun stuff because the duffel bag is just close. It has all my hair stuff it has my shampoo my conditioner my leave-in conditioner uh, the oil that I'm gonna need for like the ends of my hair we got body wash we got shaving cream and then we have some face wash and some oil cleanser just in case we wear makeup. We got our hair straightener. Uh, by the way, if you're ever looking for a good hair straightener, I've had this hair straightener, I'm not even shitting you, for like 10 years. And it's absolutely amazing. It's a Paul Mitchell hair, like a flat iron. It's the Pro Tools. It's quite amazing. Some makeup brushes, again, just in case we decide to do our makeup. If I do my makeup, it's probably just gonna be face makeup. I'm not gonna do any like eyeshadow or whatever. I, I highly doubt I'm going to, but just in case just in case. Speaking of makeup, <laughs> we have a plethora of options. Makeup that I will be bringing, just in case. I almost broke stuff. Um, I'm bringing two different foundations. Actually, no, I'm not gonna bring two different ones. Bring the Sephora Skin Better Foundation, because this is great. I'm going to bring the Rare Beauty Concealer, which is also great. I'm also bringing my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer, uh, just in case I want to 
like have a little bit fuller coverage like on my face. Fenty Cream Bronzer, Fenty Cream Blush, Too Faced Hangover, ho ho Too Faced Hangover RX Primer, Make a Forever Mist and Fix, Mac Fix Plus. Just because I have a little left, and I prefer I prefer this a little bit over the uh, Mist and Fix. Even though neither of them are really like a setting spray, but I really don't care. The Maybelline Stay Matte Powder, which She's basically done. The Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette. Mascara for the bottom lash. One of the Jaclyn Hill Face Duo powders. Another thing that we're gonna bring with us, but I'm gonna put this in my bag over there for like car purposes. I'm gonna give myself a little under eye treatment in the car with these little uh, eye masks. So those are gonna be nice. I'm gonna throw those in my bag. I also have my ear pods in there. Another change of view, hello. Another thing that I have to actually throw in that bag real quick, we're bringing this little laundry bag that I got from Target, because I was like, hmm, I could bring a trash bag, but I'll get a laundry bag instead, because I can reuse this at home. Got some travel toothbrushes for Mike and I, toothpaste, some Listerine, disposable masks just in case. Got some snack, goldfish, some Smart Sweets, which I've never had these before, but I heard they're really good. This is my favorite. Got some Famous Amos cookies. And to be quite honest, I'm sure we'll get more snacks. It's 13 hours, but we're stopping halfway and then continuing. And now my actual favorite bag of this trip. I got this bag off of Amazon. It's absolutely amazing. It comes with two bowls like this that are collapsible. It's a water bowl and it's a, like there's a water bowl and a food bowl, so it's fantastic. So we got two of those. We have our little poopy bags on the side, which I also like to bring extra ones just in case. On the inside, I have two of these. They both have her food in them. I've actually individually bagged them for each day. And of course I bring a little bit of extra just in case. Her little joint treat treats. She's got her, her wipes. I use baby wipes because they're unscented, they're fine, whatever. Got two bones for her, got a toy, and I got her towel. So that's Winnie's bag. It's probably the best bag out of all of ours. Yeah, so that's basically the stuff that we're bringing. I'm sure I'll figure out some last minute things to throw in my bag, but I hope you guys enjoyed this little pack with me. It's definitely not as aesthetic as I thought it was gonna be because I have to leave here in 20 minutes for an appointment. So I was like, oh, let me film this real quick since we're leaving tomorrow. Well, actually, when you see this video, I'll already be home, but that's not the point. I'm also probably going to be vlogging our trip, possibly. So if you're interested in that, definitely subscribe. Winnie says thanks for watching. Subscribe. Subscribe. You're so gorgeous.